because, and I'm just sick and tired of this carousel of quarterbacks. Who's going to be? Is it going to be Trey? Is it going to be Sam Donald? Oh my God, he hasn't played with a good team. He hasn't had good players around him. He hasn't had a coach like Kyle. Is it going to be Brock? You know what I mean? It's like, I know, I know this is where we're at, unfortunately, but man, it's like, we're, we're only here because of Kyle, though. Yeah. Yep. Kyle's Thank the you. one that decided to push things off, uh, getting quarterbacks and quarterbacks and quarterbacks. Then he has all of a sudden a team and he's like, shoot, we need a quarterback now. And then all of a sudden he decides he doesn't want this quarterback because his quarterback decided not to come back at the end of a worthless season. And then he decides to rationally move off that quarterback, move up, give up three years of first round compensation to get a quarterback that he's not going to give the chance for this. This is the most rich kid shit I've ever seen before. Trey Lance is the Ferrari wrapped around the tree. And mm. Kyle Shanahan down the road, calling dad. Instead of taking ownership for that. Yeah. The whole accident of what happened. Just, just bail me out. Right. Bail me out. I don't want to take responsibility for what happened. I just bail me up with another car. That's a pretty good segment right there, uh, Ryan. Can't argue that point. And uh, there has to be some point where Kyle needs to accept responsibilities and admit but we screwed he's, up. I screwed he's got up. A, he's got a rich kid for a boss. He's got a kid who's – he's got a person just like him as his boss – who understands that he did the same thing? He's not going to yeah. judge you for that because he knows he did it. Yeah, and a, and a rich kid nerd that wants friends for a boss. Yes, yes. Yep. And he's got a he owns a whole team full of cool guys. 